since when it changes. Yeah, yeah, it's sort of <laughs> more and more like a And uh, when I was 10 years ago, Bruegel is, is, is a painter who creates his own world, which I inhabited a long time ago. I mean, I, I, I spent a lot of time in front of his paintings in Vienna, in Kunsthistorische. And uh, he always pulls you in. You just enter his world like the world of Fellini. I mean, and also I, I keep thinking of Altman, who was trying to, in his movies, to do a lot of simultaneous action, like in the Nashville and, you know, the action here, the action there, the action here. Bruegel does it in one space, but it's like you have several various actions and your eye goes from one to the other to the other and makes a fantastic connections and if you spend a little bit more time than usual you start to narrate yourself what's going on I mean, the films that are escaping themselves and escaping people, it just all is based on speed. Fast cutting, running away from the theme, from the interior of the people, from the essence of, of our existence. It just runs away. It just, it's, you know, you take a drug called speed. You watch the movie, which is speed. You watch a TV program, which is an idiotic speed, right? And you just, based the, the civilization based on speeding away from yourself. So Bruegel for me is a con contemplating artist who sort of brings me back to myself and brings me back to the world which was somewhat ordered. <laughs> 